Uh, this place is called OTL. I'll see whether I can see a signboard or something. Ah, uh, video is getting very bad. Guys, this has got to be the smallest drone I've ever seen. This is a what? Mop Beetle. Mop Beetle 6. Check out the size compared to the Mark 4. Shit, that is cute. <laughs> Guys, this thing flies awesome. Now, I don't know much about this. All I can see is like, it is a whoop size. Now, whoops are those really tiny drones that you normally fly indoors, but watching the drone fly around, it is performing very well, right? For such a small size drone. When, when I'm thinking about what to say, this, this is what people around me will tend to do. <laughs> Hello, bus quickly pass by so anyways not my drone i don't know much about it but it flies awesome you want to know more about it click the link in the description whose is it it's my cousin here hi okay brian brian's an awesome pilot also so you can also go and have a look at his channel right and know more about models like this one here and do like and subscribe to this channel and like this video Show us some love lah. Like, subscribe and all that. Okay, DJI FPV fam, a change of flavor. I'm gonna be flying this guy a bit more since I, yeah, ever since I flew the DJI FPV, I haven't really spent a lot of time on DIY FPV. This is the Gap RC Mark IV HD5. I, um, I still find it's an excellent drone. Complete, all you need, good motors, great ESC, flies well. I think in the near future, I'm gonna set a course for you guys. Like, if you wanna cross over to DIY FPV, like, what are some of the drones that you could get now? This is a digital drone. You could always also go with his options, right? He's mainly running a lot of um, analog, still on analog. Uh, there are some digital, there are some analog options here. Okay, digital? So usually I fly whoops and micros, so they are slightly smaller than, than the five inch ones. Mm -hmm. So these are because, I mean, this is because the, it's easy to carry around a park flyer and doesn't disturb anyone, less noise. Seriously, one five inch drone, he can fit four drones in his backpack, right? And they are, they are definitely a lot more quieter than a five inch. If you're gonna be sending this thing, it's gonna really scream, all right? Um, so if you're like uh, wanting to fly drones safely, um, especially if you know like you're in a park, there are people around, then one of the courses that you could take is instead of flying such a big ass drone, go get yourself a whoop size, be it digital or analog. You, you toss it at me? Can or not? Toss. <laughs> even, if, even if this thing was to bump into someone, not saying you should, because you should not be flying near people, but at least if you were to bump something like this into someone, it's not gonna it's not going to really hurt lah. Uh, it's not going to hurt so much. Uh. End of the day, still, flying safe is the way to go. Right? Alright guys, let's get flying. Enjoy the video. Okay, okay Brian's got to run. Ciao. See you fam. Till next one. Like this video. Subscribe <laughs> to this channel. Ciao brother. <laughs> See you man. Okay, bye bye. Alright, let's get going. I'm losing light very fast here. I guess that's what's gonna happen when you meet up with your cousin and you chit chat and you totally forget that you're out here to fly but it's alright I'm just here to get some stick time in um, okay first flight let's do some warm up with flips okay flips are alright okay let's no that's not flips that's rolls okay let's do flips then okay sticks feel good Go around and check out the scene around here. Hmm, video is getting fuzzy. Can't be what? I'm so close by. I'm not that far away. Hmm. Okay, split ass. Let's do an orbit. Let's reverse that orbit. Under speed S.
let's explore the place a bit ah uh, video is getting very bad i do not know why yeah sorry guys all right i'm on my second and probably last bet because um yeah losing light very fast here um but i'm just gonna go and cruise around the area kind of give you some view of what's what's there over at this place All right uh this place is called otl i'll see whether i can see a signboard or something ah uh, video is getting very bad what is wrong i'm not that far away okay bad in this corner also i'm i'm seeing my goggle view right now um okay i'll push it as far as i can but i'm only like in this area i start to see drops in my signal yeah i already have one bar drop okay uh, yep oh no oh no two bars left it's red okay gonna just i have no choice okay let's just fly around this tree then maybe if i go up of the view from on top here guys i can't really um, enjoy flying because all i have is um, bad video all right um, i can't keep losing it because i do not want to get stuck in the trees over here maybe i'll just play a few gaps are there gaps uh gap another gap uh, bad video I'm having some issues with my video feed I do not know whether it's my channel choice or whether it is um, something is going wrong with the air unit here right but that's what DIY is about right you'll if you find something is wrong you got to bring it back put it on the bench open it up and then give it a thorough check maybe sometimes it's as simple as just a, a loose connection or maybe you got um, uh, solder that has gone cold like it has dislodged or something like that the drones that you saw earlier now those are really good options right whoops that are easy to bring around not that pricey also comes in digital and analog so if you don't want to go through the analog route and you want to stick with your dji digital goggles right uh, the goggles v2 anyways um, you kind of got to go and get the digital drones uh, what brian has are good offerings that are at a lower price point and also digital so maybe you could go and have a look at those okay i'm gonna wrap it up guys if you like this video give me a thumbs up subscribe if you're not already chat with me i'll get back to you as soon as i can pilots as always i'll see you in the skies peace i'll see you next week